I'm privileged to lead the Wells learning and development efforts in Shell. We work on wells in many different geographical and geological settings. Sometimes hydrocarbon resources are located many miles underneath the earth or sea surface, often in harsh or off offshore environment settings. The work we do is technologically complex. We rely on input from different areas of expertise across many companies, and we actively manage risk in all that we do. Our prime objectives are to carry out our work efficiently, and we have a track record of doing so safely. Historically, our learning and development programs have focused on deep technical analysis and understanding of various geological and engineering challenges pertaining to accessing oil and gas reservoirs. We pride ourselves on developing our engineers to the most advanced level. Getting the best out of our people is in our DNA and we are constantly looking for ways to offer new insights to better prepare for the challenges faced. What I want to talk about today is one of our latest improvement efforts. We are conscious that for us to deliver beyond best in class, our existing technical excellence needs to be coupled with excellence in how we engage and lead our teams. The airline industry calls this crew resource management. We have adopted the term human factors. What you see behind me our live data feeds from our drilling simulator here in the Netherlands. We aim to couple different technologies so that we can practice our human factor skills in a controlled and simulated environment whilst being observed here in a 3D visualization center. This way we can assess and offer our course participants individual feedback on critical issues like situational awareness, communication, decision making and general leadership. We believe that this facilitated through deep psychological expertise, will give new insights that they can take back to their places of work. Our first course of participants will experience this in August 2017. We are also keen to enhance integration by bringing subsurface inputs into the wells simulated environment. It is not far-fetched to think of a future where seismic data, pore pressure, fracture gradients and subsurface risks are brought directly and swiftly into well simulators. This will help close the current knowledge gap between subsurface risks and operational reality as experienced by our teams. It will also enhance our understanding of the complex downhole condition we face in our work. It is also not far-fetched to think of a future where we bring in live data feeds from ongoing wells operations into the same environment. This way we can build advanced experience as learners face the challenge and buzz of ongoing operations, all in a virtual environment. Another extension would be to bring integrated simulators onto our sometimes remote drilling rigs and include direct feeds from subsurface predictions and risks. This way we would enable our operational teams to drill the day shift on the simulator before they actually go and do so in real life. In Shell, we aspire to power progress together by providing more and cleaner energy solutions. The digital age offers exciting opportunities and I believe that only our imagination sets limits to how we best can deploy today's and future technologies in that aim. So, let's make the future. Let's be the difference that our planet and people need. Thank you.